We check in now on the latest cattle market news with our market update brought to you by Cattle Facts. Hello, I'm Lance Zimmerman with the Cattle Facts update. The weekly U.S. fed cattle slaughter reported by the USDA for the last week in June was estimated at 492,000 head. The weekly volume is more than 30,000 head larger than year-ago levels. However, the slaughter level was still 20,000 head smaller than the five-year five average for the same week. This has been a relatively normal trend for fed cattle slaughter over the last 12 weeks. Through that period, fed slaughter was averaged at 476,000 head per week. That is 16,000 head per week smaller than the five-year average, but 34,000 larger than last year. Choice beef production from a carcass count basis has been a different story. The USDA choice grading percentage for fed cattle has been identical over the last 12 weeks compared to the same period in 2015 at 68.9%. That percentage is 13 and a half points stronger than the five-year average. Combine a steady year-over-year -year choice grading percentage with increasing fed cattle slaughter, and the result is 20,000 more choice carcasses per week than 2015. The significance of that six and a half percent increase relative to last year is that it came during a critical demand period for choice middle meats. When it comes to steak items, piece counts tend to matter more than pounds. Even with increasing carcass weights, a carcass only produces two subprimal cuts per carcass for ribeyes, strip loins, tenderloins, and top sirloins. During the last 12 weeks, the choice select spread has averaged more than $15 per hundredweight. In fact, it reached a record high spring daily value in early June at more than $25. And last week, the fed slaughter and quality grade mix produced the largest number of choice carcasses in the last five years. The demand generated for middle meats through stronger retail beef featuring this summer is evident from the choice select spread staying above $10 per hundredweight in recent weeks, even as choice carcass counts increased. Cattlefax expects the spread to narrow considerably into late summer as choice production remains elevated and summer grilling demand fades. Anticipate a summer spread low somewhere between $5 and $8 per hundredweight in late July or early August. For the Angus Report and Cattle Facts, I'm Lance Zimmerman. To learn more about Cattle Facts, your leading source for beef industry market information, visit cattlefacts.com.